morning, everyone. I just quickly went to the bathroom, did my stuff, and <clears throat> quickly got dressed. I'm wearing a tank top today, and I have these, like, shorts on here that I've gotten from Old Navy, like, a couple years ago. So, since I'm not going anywhere today, I'm just here with the boy, with Logan, and then later just have to get Aubrey off the bus. So, I am just going to wear this. But I'm going to get myself my breakfast and my coffee now. Um, because need to get that. So here's my cup. Let me get, I'm going to have to, to tie this up here. I'm going to tie it up. Hello, Logan. You eating? Logan's eating. Hi, oh boy. But, so I'm going to put another Walmart delivery through today, guys. I'm like out of yogurt, out of milk. Um, out of a couple other items that Aubrey wants. So I'm going to do another Walmart delivery today. Oh, goodness. Get more stuff out here. Let me grab the ice. And I did like step out of my comfort zone the other day on 4th of July, you guys. I wore like one of my um, like patriotic tank tops that I've had for like years from Walmart. And then I wore my white shorts. And I'm like, ooh. It's just family that I was around, so that's why I wore them. Because I don't give a shit, it's just family. <laughs> But you won't catch me wearing them out in public. And they weren't like jean white shorts. They were like um, cotton material shorts. So they were comfortable. But I just wouldn't be com like comfortable wearing them in public because of my thighs and everything. <coughs> That's just how I am. But making some coffee here. Aubrey's been liking summer school, which is good. What, Logan? You eating? You eating numbers? He's got a little cough. And his nose is scarred now, you guys. So he fell at home and landed right on their cement. And his nose was like all like cut up and all that. Well, it, his actual nose didn't bleed. It was just the top of his nose that was cut up that bled. And now it's like a scar because of it. So. This is that coffee that I made yesterday, you guys. I put it in here. Like I told you I was going to do. Let me get my two packets of stuff over here. Um, <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, you're barking. My dad says, look at the girl's cough. He's like, okay, enough barking, enough barking. You silly. He had a banana, a whole banana. Um, these French toast things that you can get from like Ego. And then I gave him a couple, um, of this 4th of July tricks that I got from Target the other day. So that is what he's eating. And I don't know what I'm going to have because I do have milk, but it's like a little bit. So if I were to have some cereal, I would have to have like a little bit of cereal, which is perfectly fine. Because I think that's what I'm going to do to use up the milk in the fridge. Because I do have like a little bit left. It's not enough for a full bowl of cereal. So, okay, mix this all in, whipped cream, <coughs> what? <laughs> He's a silly boy. Okay guys, look at this. Oh, I love my some iced coffee. Homemade, like, don't get me wrong, Dunkin's is better than this, but at least a homemade coffee is a good homemade coffee. <laughs> mm. Yes. So, last night, you guys want to end the vlog? I went to go lay down. <laughs> what? Finish your food. I went to go lay down, you guys, and I, um, like, literally fell right to sleep. Like, right to sleep. Had no problem put shut the light off and I literally had no problem falling asleep last night. 
<laughs> like, I fell right to sleep. But, is that good, boy? You Logan. You Logan. Hey, 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 hey. No. No. Okay, we're all done. Okay, guys, well, I'm going to get him out here and get my breakfast, and I'll see you guys later. Hey, guys. Whew, so, just got my delivery here. Logan left. Got Aubrey. Um, did my basic thing with Logan today, like we always do. And then we got Aubrey off the bus. She had lunch. Logan had lunch. Um, I had some leftover sloppy joe casserole that i made the other night i had like one there was like one little piece left and i ate that for lunch um and then we were just sitting watching cocomelon and then logan left and then um i put a walmart delivery through this morning so i'm just gonna show instead of hold doing a whole a separate video just gonna show you guys now so i did get a gallon of milk i'm gonna put this in the fridge now Um, and then I did get Aubrey more of her milk and I did get more half and half, half and half. And then another thing of the, of the ready whip, no, the, what do you want to call it? The dairy whip topping. Um, I am completely out of shredded cheese. So I got the Fiesta blend. Um, and then you guys, I've been wanting to get like cheese sticks lately, but with fetch. So if you guys don't know about fetch, I believe I have it. I'll have my code in the description box. If you guys want to try out fetch, basically you sign up and, um, for fetch. It's an app on your phone. It's free. You scan every receipt that you get and you get points and the points add up to, to um, gift cards. So I think it's like 350 points right now for the for the Sargento cheese sticks. Like any of them it has to be over 7.9 ounces. This one's nine ounces. So I got like 300 something points for this cheese sticks. I think this was like three something at Walmart. Um, and then I did get a big thing of my roasted garlic sauce, my Rayos. This is my favorite sauce. Um, this is a substitution. I did want one pack of the other brand. Of, like it was Capri Sun, but it was a cooling something. But instead they substituted it for two of the um, fruit punch because I wanted the Kool-Aid jammers, um, pouches, things. They didn't have that. So they substituted it for two of the fruit punch. Then I did get uh, another whole pack of my A&W Zero Sugar root beer which i do allow aubrey to have one here and there because they are zero sugar and there is no caffeine so i do allow aubrey to have some of this and then i did get a big bag here which i'm gonna have to um separate these into baggies once i'm done but it's a big bag of it's five pounds of drumsticks from walmart so let me go put this cheese away real quick And then I did get um, some more um, garlic toast, which I always take it out of the box and put it in the freezer that way, you guys, because it comes with a um, Thai thing there already. So it just saves up room in your freezer. Up this other bread here and then let me get some more stuff here i did get so i have some salad in the fridge that i got from price shopper the other day uh we went for a walk to price shopper so i wanted to get some like chicken to eat in the salad for when i want like chicken salad so i got this purdue 100 all natural carb chicken breast 20 gr um, grams of protein 100 calories per serving so i got that and then more cheese. I got mozzarella cheese. Like I said, I have no shredded cheese at all. And then I got some sharp cheddar cheese. And then um, they substituted one of my yogurts. I guess they didn't have one of the flavors that I asked for. 
So they substitute it with a strawberry one, which is obviously fine. So I got a strawberry one, a coconut one. This is of the two good. A coconut one, another strawberry one. I basically got one of each, but then they substituted it for another strawberry one. Um, black cherry, blueberry, uh, mango hibiscus or whatever. This one's actually really good. This one, very good. Um, mixed berry, uh, peach, and then mayor meyer lemon and i'm guessing they must have been out of the the vanilla one that's what i'm guessing that they must have been out of because i forget which one they substituted okay and then in this bag i have i'm gonna quickly go through this and then just put all this stuff away um i got two of the 73 lean 25 percent fat ground beefs so two of those i have I got some more of the onion soup mix. I love to put this in my meatloaf. I would definitely recommend for you guys to try it. One pound of beef or turkey or whatever you're going to use. And then one whole packet of the onion soup mix. So good. So good. And Frank loves it. And then I did get two of the, um, Ben's original rice peel off. Aubrey's going to be loving that. Um, and then I did get a um some red grapes like the ones that they put together for you of red grapes and then some blueberries so logan hasn't had blueberries at my house for like i feel like over two weeks so i did get some blueberries um and then in this bag here i have some turkey meatballs i got some turkey meatballs this time instead of the regular meatballs because I realize that the bread meatballs I usually get are like 200 something calories for six meatballs. This is 120 calories for six meatballs, which isn't much difference, but I feel like turkey is better than having like the regular ones. Um, and then I did get a personal sized watermelon here. And then I did get two more bananas. So personal sized watermelon. I'm gonna have to cut that up tonight because the past two times that I've gotten watermelons, they've gone bad, like right away. And then I did get some more dino nuggets. And then the last bag here, I got some sub rolls for the meatballs. And then one more loaf of the 40 calorie bread. So that's everything you guys. Now I gotta put all this stuff away. Uh -huh. Gotta put all this stuff away. But yeah, that's everything that I got, you guys. Gotta go over here to the freezer and get everything to fit. Which it will. It will all fit. I just gotta move some stuff around is what I gotta do to get it all to fit. Once I put those drumsticks in, like, their own bags, um, I take, like, zip sandwich bags and put, like, two drumsticks in each sandwich bag. Then they fit perfect in the freezer. If I were to put that whole bag in there, then I would literally have to like cook it all at once when I take it out to, un to unfreeze it. I would literally have to cook the whole thing because I stuck the whole thing in there. So I'm gonna stick this new one in the freezer because I just got it. Put that in the freezer. And then is there anything else for the freezer? I'll make sure I'm not missing anything else for the freezer. Just the drumsticks here that I gotta do for the freezer. I believe that's all for the freezer. Um, and now I gotta do this stuff for the fridge here. Uh, let me put you guys right here in my fridge for a second. Yeah, I'm still wearing those black shorts and I just put this shirt on, you guys. So for dinner, I think I'm gonna have some leftover buffalo chicken dip that I made the other night. Um, on Saturday, I made buffalo chicken dip when Frank was gone at the racetrack and we I was watching the pay-per-view. So I'm thinking about having, uh, oh goodness, I'm thinking about having some of that to get it gone. That's what I was thinking about having. So let me go grab my yogurt. My yogurt. Now that I think about it, how long does yogurt last? How long? I'm going to have to look up how long yogurt can last 
in the fridge because this is from June 21st. They gave me, they gave me June 21st. They gave me July 18th, which is fine. June 24th, June 21st. Oh God, I'm gonna have to eat these up. August 2nd, which August 2nd's good and the July one is good here. Let me see what the other ones are. Um, this one right here is, where the heck is it, where is it, where is it? What did you do, Aubrey? I'm ready to order. I'm trying to look at the thing, what did you do? Go put it in the bathroom, please. Go put it in the bathroom. Okay, go put it in the bathroom. I can't figure out the date on this one, you guys. But then this one is July 18th, which is fine. And July 20th, which is fine. So there's like four of them here that are like expired. So I don't know what's up with that. Don't know what's up with that, you guys. And then just these two here. Okay, guys. Well, I'm going to get this chicken all put together. Um, and then I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, it's 11.57. I am going to head to bed. I'm so tired, you guys. So tired. Took my shower and then I was cleaning some stuff in the kitchen. But now I'm going to shut off my SVU over here and I am going to go to bed. So if you guys have an awesome day and I'll see you guys tomorrow.